I get told the smaller version of Bruno. <laughs> Always try and be positive and go forward, but don't force it. Athletic, strong, technically gifted. Nice high line, press everything you possibly can. Just relax and try and enjoy it. It's, it's, it can be quite daunting. <laughs> Pre-season is well underway and the transfer merry-go-round is in full swing with players searching for a new club. Today we are down at Hartsdale Park, home to Margate FC. They're holding a trial game, trying to find a little gem to bolster their squad. I've even bought the boots, just in case. Margate posted the trial date on their Twitter account and asked players to apply online. There were over 80 applicants in total, 44 were selected and 33 have confirmed. But we know what non-league players are like. How many will turn up? We just don't know. Taking on the managerial reins this season is former professional footballer Andy Drury. He played for the likes of Luton, Stevenage and Ipswich. And it's his job to try and beat last season's eighth place finish in the Ithmian Premier League. Good luck, Andy. Andy, what made you put this trial on today? I just think it's important that we, we do, a, do a trial day just to um, see if there's any, anything hanging about in the local areas that uh, we don't miss out on, really. Of the squad that was here last year, how many have you retained? Um, there is Ben Bridlecard, Harrison Hatfall, Lewis Knight, Ben Greenhow and Sam Batman. So there's five. We've added another five as well plus a couple of the under 23s that are going to come do pre-season with us. Um, overall, we're looking for another four or five players, Max. Is there a specific type of player that you're looking for? Specific positions and specific characters that we need. We're a club that's had good team spirit over the last year or so, and I'm looking to continue that because I believe that that can gain you more points. Yeah, we'll see We'll see what happens out today. And what type of manager are you? I want to play good football. I want them to enjoy it. And ultimately, I want to win. Um, which is the most important thing in football. Dustin Cooper, I'm a midfielder and I'm 22 years old. Your journey from America to England? A couple years back, just had a chance to come play out in England, just down in York and then I moved from York to Newcastle, took the four and a half hour journey down to Margate just a couple days back. And what made you apply for this trial? Just the reputation of the club. I was interested in Margate. I came down, I loved the training, loved the guys that were there, and I wanted to come back. And how would you describe yourself as a player? Oh, I love to get on the ball. Love a little, little touch if I can get one. Definitely love going to goal. That's, that's definitely me. And if you could liken yourself to any pro in the game, who would it be? That's a tough one. I get told the smaller version of Bruno. <laughs> that's what I get told. <laughs> for looks as well, for some reason. Right, what we're going to do, we're going to have a little warm-up between the two teams. I'll take a team, Scotty will take a team. And then uh, we'll go into a full-size game. We'll do, try and do three 30 minutes and see how we go. My name is Vax Fernandes. I'm 20 years old, centre-back. Previously at Tilbury, Leatherhead and also at Clapton FC. And how would you describe yourself as a player? Athletic, strong, technically gifted and just a very confident player, I'll say. And if you could liken your game to anyone, who would it be? Right now, I enjoy watching Matip and Rudiger. I enjoy them, yeah. Try and play two and three touch as much as you can. Yeah. Secondly, I want you to play as high line as you possibly can as well. Because we are looking to play a high line this year. So there's no point in us trying to do anything else if that's what we're looking to do this season. Press everything you possibly can. Just go and press us, fellas. Alright, don't leave anything to chance. Just go and do as much as you can. Alright, fellas? Alright, out you go.
me, boys, but when you're playing, just be patient. Enjoy having the ball. Sometimes you're forcing long balls and it's not actually on, or you're going into places just forcing things. Just come out sometimes. Just keep the ball. We always try and be positive and go forward, but don't force it. Just come out and go the other way. We'll keep being patient. We'll keep moving them. Then the gaps will come as they get tired. Then we can play through. Sometimes we're having four, five, six touches in centimetres. They ain't actually going anywhere. So you can do it in one touch. Just pop it, pop it, come out. All right? Yeah. Okay? Just enjoy it. Dominate possession and relax. <laughs> Freden, 20 years old, um, midfielder. And what clubs have you played for before? Tottenham and QPR. And you scored an absolute worldie. That can only be a good thing. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, it was a good goal, to be fair. I enjoyed it. And that was on your left foot? Yeah. What foot are you? Uh, right, more dominant, but I'd say both. Look, for me, I think a few of you just need to show for the ball a bit more. And there's too many times we've got the ball and we haven't got, we haven't got no options. We want the ball. Everyone want the ball. That goal that we conceded when I'm asking you to split, you should be doing that anyway. I don't want to be in a team that's just going to whack the ball as far as they can. I tried to play the block yeah. back to play that way. Yeah, no, it's probably, it, off guard. it's probably just coming off of what I said. But you should be doing that automatically. As soon as he gets it, peel off. You peel off the other side, alright? Um, half hour left. Try and win this game, alright? Dustin, what did you make of the performance? Ah, it was it was good playing with some players, but it's a bit different. It's a little bit difficult to play with guys you never played with before. I thought that I stood out a little bit in the middle, talking the whole time from begin to end. My voice is a little bit gone now, but it's definitely something I still I had energy from beginning to end. Just not knowing people changed a little bit, but definitely happy to come out and get touches today. Do you think you'll get the call for pre-season next week? I really do hope so. I really do hope so. We're happy with the quality out there, mate. Um, yeah. Pleased with some of the performances. We've got to sit down now and um, just go through who we want to come back for pre-season. Um, but like I said, thank, thanks from us. Um, safe journey home and we'll be in touch with some of you. The following players were invited to join Margate for pre-season. It's now down to them to try and earn a contract.